Hey guys, alright guys, welcome back to my, my series on quarantine cocktails, easy to make, easy to get ingredients, three to four ingredients max. Today I'm rocking the sombrero, we are making a margarita. It's a three ingredient cocktail, four if you want to opt to add sugar. First, you need tequila. Second, it comes from France, way back from 1849. It's Cointreau. The last ingredient, we need a citrus. That citrus is lime. So that's all you need, so let's get into this and it goes out the way. Cocktail shaker. Step one, grab your cocktail shaker. If you don't have a cocktail shaker, you can use a Tupperware box or, or a coffee cup or, or what else can you use, Hannah? If you don't have a shaker, what else can you use? A Tupperware box with a lid on. Tupperware box with a lid on. So, we're going to jump right in, no messing about today, with the tequila. We're going to do 40 millilitres of a tequila, a good quality tequila. You want to look for one that says that it's 100% agave, that's going to give you the best margarita possible. Second is your Cointreau, orange liqueur, it's going to add a bit of zestiness, it's going to add a bit of sweetness. And we're going to go in with 20 milliliters of our poncho or whatever orange liqueur you can get your hands on in the current climate. Last but not least, we're going to need that lime juice. So, quick lime in half. If you've got a juicer, you use a juicer. We're not all that privileged. So we're just going to squeeze this lime, try not to get any of the pips in there. And then there's one. We go with Two. We're looking for 25 millilitres of lime juice, which if you're not doing this with a measure on and you've got shot glass, is just, just under lime. So not quite full, but pretty much. And there we go. Oh, perfect. Again, 25 millilitres. Now, that's it for your margarita. If you want to add a little bit of sweetness, you can grab evil. 10 or 15 millilitres, just a dash of simple syrup. If you don't have that, just a spoon of sugar. I'm going to opt for the sweetness because I like my margarita sweet. If you've got agave, you can do a squirt of agave, make it a Tommy's margarita. If you're not sure what Tommy's margarita is and you're watching this video on YouTube, check the description. I've got a link in there to my blog. It's got this recipe on as well as a bunch of other margarita recipes and the whole margarita history. So, check that out. Fill your shake with ice. If you are opting to add a tablespoon of sugar, you're going to have to have a really vigorous shake. So you can serve this cocktail either in a chill coupe or a rocks glass with ice, it's totally up to you, personal preference, feel free to just dab a bit of salt around the rim, feel free to not, it's up to you, it's your cocktail. There we go, Uno Margarita. I'm going to opt for just a lime wheel, stick that on the side like so. There we have it, Uno Margarita, three ingredients, four of you up for a bit of sweetness, perfect for lockdown, perfect for quarantine, perfect for making at home. Let's give it a taste, let's see how it is. Blimey. Mmm, mmm, beautiful, that right there hits the spot. Hannah, would you like to taste the margarita? Sure. Go ahead, reach on in, grab my margarita. That was delicious. Oh, heard it here first, delicious. Give it a try. I didn't know there was dill in it. Oh, 